Okay, you want to go noise cancellation? You go noise cancellation. Uh huh. Would it sound muffled with the no. noise cancellation? No. no. Right there. Huh? Is the thing is the you attach the blue color? The, yeah, you attach blue. this one, right? Okay, it's green. There, you see green? Oh, okay. The green. That's okay. a full mic. Nice cancellation. Okay. All right. So, uh, can you tell me the issues that you're having now? So my issue is that I think uh, near my rhomboid area is very tight, and where whatever position I sit down or move around is very uncomfortable, and it sometimes restricts my movement as well. Okay. So I I think that is one of the problems, especially when I do bench press. Yeah. Like when yep. I kind of like trying to close my shoulder blades, it kind of restricts that movement as well. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So okay. it's okay. yeah very discomfort. Okay. Then you show me uh like you do the. Okay, you put your hand across the body. Put my hand. Just, just, just the hand across okay. the body. Okay. And then you turn your head over there and look down. Okay. Do you feel that tightness there? Yep, yep. It's like a stretch. Yeah, it actually feels stretch, good right? when I stretch. Yeah, like you this. actually feels that stretch. Right? You yeah. feel like the nerve is coming off, right? Uh, yeah, right? It's yeah. Timing, it's right? getting okay. like loosened. So, okay, just come over here. So, okay, just relax. Okay. So, what's happening now is that there are a couple of nerves here that that are running on, running straight, right? There is your spinal accessory nerve, which lies next to the to the thoracic spine, and then there's your dorsal scapular nerve, which is just right underneath the scapula. So what is likely happening is that what I was doing was that I was just doing a test to find out the feeling. You feel that it's a more positive yep, when you feel yep, this, right? Yep. So what That's I was just mean. trying to do was to see, get the nerves to slide underneath the rhomboids as well as is uh is a posterior serratus superior so when he when he does that and he's trapped as well he's going to get the nerves to slide up upwards so what i'm going to do is that i'm just going to get the nerves to slide a little bit better and see whether he still gets that, still gets that same feeling but i will just release the rhomboids first okay take a, you just take a seat a seat so i'm going to just release the rhomboids he's just doing uh sitting on this position okay, okay. you just want to sit closer here so that at least i got more le uh, leverage so i'm just going to just Work on releasing the rhomboids. Just relax. Yeah? Oh. Okay. Just gonna work on releasing the rhomboids. Just relax. Just relax. So what I'm doing is just retracting the shoulder, and then I'm just going to elevate the shoulder slightly. Okay. Can you feel that? Yeah. I'm feeling a lot. A bit sore, right? I'm just releasing the rhomboids just to get the nerve to slide. Okay. 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 I'm also going to work on the posterior serratus superior, but before because the nerves goes through that muscle as well. Okay. So what's going to happen? You put your hand here. Okay. Okay. Then your head is going to turn from here. You're going to turn, rotate, and look down. Okay. Okay. And then I'm going to ask you to inhale and exhale, okay? okay. So you just follow my lead. Okay. So I'm going to put my hand on the posterior serratus superior, uh -huh. okay? This position, okay? Mm -hmm. You're going to exhale, rotate your head, look down, and oh, then inhale, okay? You okay? okay? You understand? Okay? Yeah. Okay. You exhale first. Okay. Now you're going to inhale again. Inhale. Okay, go. Contralaterally bend, rotate, contralaterally rotate, and then look down. Okay, look down, look down, there. Okay, and then inhale. Good. Okay, one more time. I'm gonna go from the top now. Okay, same thing, huh? Uh -huh. Okay, go. Movement, go, 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 exhale, go, go, rotate, laterally bend. Okay, inhale. Okay, good. Come back again one more time. Okay, go again. Go. Exhale. Go, 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 go. Now inhale. Good. Okay. So now I'm going to be, now I'm ready to work on the nerves. Okay. But before I do that, I just want you to feel your back first. Uh -huh. Does it feel better? Uh definitely. You turn, 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 I, turn, turn, turn there, look down. Feels a bit looser here. Yeah. Yeah. I can't feel as much of the feeling I felt just now. Okay. Which, which I think is a... So now I'm going to get the nerves to slide just to release it even further, okay? Okay. Just relax around. Just, just, just relax around, okay? So I'm going to get my finger behind the dorsal, behind uh -huh. the scapula into the dorsal scapula nerve. Okay. So I'm just finding it now. 
So I'm going to anchor it down in the inferior manner. Mm -hmm. I'm going to rotate. Okay. okay. Let's find it. Should I move? No, no, no. no. You don't move anything. Okay. There. Okay. Now you're going to turn your head towards the left. Turn, turn. Turn your head. And then look down towards your left head. Good. Feel that? Yep. Okay. Come back. I'm going to go on the medial portion of the nerve. It's a nerve bundle there. You go again. Now you go turn your head and look down to your left hip. Okay, oh, I felt that. Felt wow. that right? Yeah, I felt that. That was such a. Back in again, go. Very. And go, go down. What I'm doing for you is I'm using ART. Okay. 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 Back in again, I'm going to work on the accessory nerve, the spinal accessory nerve for you. Okay. Uh -huh. Same thing. Go. Go. Turn, look down. Although the spinal accessory nerve, I got to go a bit higher for you. Uh -huh. Go back down there and go turn and look down. Okay, one more mm. time. Go in, go down. Spinal accessory now. Feel that? Yep. Okay. Wow, this now, is a very. Now, oh, felt very okay, wait, I'm going to go in now. Huh? I'm going to work on the There's another spinal, spinal, spinal accessory nerve from the top. Okay. This position is just going to look down, okay? okay. So I'm going to work all where it exits the splenius services okay. into the traps. Okay. okay, go turn your head towards the. Wait, uh, sorry. Turn your head towards the left. Tilt your head towards the left. Tilt, tilt, tilt. Turn your head, tilt. And then look down the left head. <sighs> okay. Try now. Move. Wow. Yeah? I feel very like soft now. Like yeah? I am able to move. You lie down your stomach face now? Very... Yeah. <laughs> Face down, face down, face down, face down. Okay. You also be restricted over here, lah. I'm just gonna do some minute for you. Inhale. Okay. Exhale. That's the one. Felt that? <laughs> okay, just relax. <laughs> so you can see that his neck, the rotation is not so good. So I'm gonna just work on this thoracic spine a little bit. That's the one. Okay. That's it. Come get up, try. Okay, how you feel? Oh. Yeah. So, okay. How do we do... Because currently, what's happening now... Uh -huh. Let's see. Take a seat. Take a seat. Currently now, what's happening now is that just last time he felt that there's a lot of tightness here. So, yep. this can result in... Because of the lengthening, right? And the compression on the nerve, right? There can be a loss of circulation over in this area. Oh. Alright. So okay. uh you don't mind taking out your shirt? Right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah. I'm gonna do the aggression now. Okay. Oh, that was a loud crack. Yeah. You heard right? I, I'm sure that the like I'm a... sure that the it, I'm sure you, you heard the I'm sure that the 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 mic the mic the yeah. mic picked it up, huh? Whoa, that was like a... Like normally, I only hear that in like maybe, I don't know, online or something. <laughs> like that? Like that? Yeah, no, you just, you just, uh, no, you just, you just take a seat. Oh, yeah, take a seat. Yeah. Yeah. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a cooling, uh, what's, what do you call that? Uh, I'm going to use this, the cooling one, because especially cooling for oil. something that is cu cu uh, currently happening, a kind of tightness that you have, a lack of circulation because of the tightness, right? Yep. And there's tightness that is compressing on the nerve. There's lack of oxygen going into the area. So I want to prevent scar tissue from, from, from forming, adhesions from forming. So I'm going to use Greston just to just to improve the circulation. So I'm just going to rub a little bit. So I want you to just put your arm across the body. And then I'm going to just rub it up. And then you will find that it will help to ease it off. So I'm going to work on the whole area, which is the chain. Okay. I'm going to work on it now. There. Work on just easing or just to get that range. I mean, you might want to turn your head, look there, so that I want to get the nerve to stretch as well. What does this uh, ointment do again? It's a cooling gel, it's uh, something gel. that to help to improve circulation to the ah, area. Okay, yeah, just to also reduce. And you can see that the redness just comes out very beautifully. Feel that. 
The arena just comes out beautifully to improve the circulation, huh? This is beauty, but okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, later huh? when you see the video, you'll see like how the arena is coming out. Yeah, okay. you'll see how the arena is coming out. It's beautiful. It makes it so easy for me to do the job. Oh, okay. Okay, done. Okay, now you try. How's that? Oh. So I'm using a cooling gel, okay? Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah, it feels very loose now. Feels very loose now, right? Very yeah. loose now. Yeah. Like my so, arm can move very freely. Yeah. And uh yeah. Yeah, there's no more tightness. Yeah. Then the biggest, biggest difference is really like there's no more tightness. Yeah. And this yeah, I can just like sit you like properly. Right. Yeah. And like there's no Yeah, I'm just gonna continue just working a little okay. bit because uh, your traps are also a little bit activated so that can pull onto the dorsal scapular nerve as well, as well as the spinal accessory nerve. Alright. I'm just going to do it for you over here. You can see it comes out very beautifully, right? Uh, see the weakness? Okay, that's not why I was just trying to <laughs> Oh man, I tell you. I mean, it's like... You just... It's like it's a colouring book, right? Yeah. Just colouring out the red. Yeah, bring yeah, on the red now. Okay, nice. Yeah. I can't really see, but uh, I think it's beautiful too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, put arm across the body. I just want to see. Okay. Let me see where the nerve... No. Nerve is right there as well, so I'm going to just work a little bit there as well. The spinal accessory nerve is right there. So, my, going to work so the problem is really like... It's a little bit of a nerve, uh, you're, you're compressing a little bit on your nerve. Okay. So let's say in the future, is there any exercise or perhaps is there anything? Uh, my, my suggestion would be to... Uh, first thing, you can use a foam roller to mobilize uh -huh. the spine. Okay. okay, mobilize the spine just to... So because it takes the pressure away from the rhomboids. Yep. Uh, stretch your chest. Uh -huh. When you stretch your chest, you will be able to uh, take the pressure away from the rhomboids. Oh. Yeah. So in between your 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 work your workouts with your on, on your shoulders, on, I mean on your rhomboids on your back, right? Yep. Stretch your chest in between when you're ah, resting. Okay. That's the one. Yeah. See. Beautiful. Oh my god. Huh? Done. Okay. So yeah. we can stop the report. Yeah, we can stop. Uh, yeah, press. Is yeah, press, press. The is it green? Yeah. Is it green? It's green. It's green. It's green. It's green. It's green. Okay. It's green. Yeah. Okay. Now. Okay. What's happening? Can you explain uh, what's happening? Uh, on so your my problem right now is my right shoulder. Yeah. Sometimes when I do uh, flies, yeah, it kind of feels this like a like a pain yeah. inside. Yeah. I'm not sure what's the yeah. issue yeah. here. Yeah. So okay, okay. So you have had it for how long already? Uh, quite a while. About maybe five months, five six five, months. Five six months. Yeah. So it's an old injury. Yeah. It's a bit chronic. Okay. So what's going to happen, right? Let me just feel it. So you can put arm across first. Yep. You're gonna raise it up, and then it starts to get blocked here. You feel that? Yeah. It starts to get blocked yep. here. So what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna open up the joint here. Uh -huh. Okay. It's fine. Yeah. Okay. Just really it's finding the joint. That's the joint. Good. It's just right there. You feel this? You feel yeah. that right there? Yeah. Yeah. So from this position, right, you're uh -huh. just gonna get your arm behind you. Okay. And use your left hand to pull across to the other side. Okay. Okay. Yep. Okay, give it up. Okay. Okay, go slowly. Go. Go. Oh, that's the guy. It's a bit tight there. Feel that? Yeah. Right there. Huh? Pull. Pull. Pull across. Yeah, bro. Pull across, man. Okay. Pull, pull, hold. 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 Give me up again. Go again. Yeah, that's the guy. Okay, now what's going to happen, right? You're going to pull across, uh -huh. same thing, here, uh -huh. and then you're going to use your elbow. You're going to lift your elbow away from this way. You feel that? Okay. Okay. So from the end range, okay. So do I still pull? You pull and then lift. Okay. Okay. I'll tell you pull when to lift. lift. Mm. Okay. Go again. Go. <laughs> pull, and then lift. Lift it. So what I'm doing is I'm working on the ligaments. On I'm working on the ligaments in the shoulder. I'm you working on the clavicular, coroco clavicular ligament, as well as a chromoclavicular ligament. Okay, come up. Now try again. Now wait. Before that, put arm across. Mm -hmm. Raise up. How's that? Oh, it's touching my nose now. <laughs> yes. Okay, next one you're going to do, uh -huh. okay? Okay, I just want to see the side up. Okay. Because the side may be a little bit more complicated. How's that? 
Yeah, this is Feels okay. Better? Yeah, this Feels is better. Good. Feels better. Yep, yep. That's great. But I can improve this some more actually. But wait, just take a seat in a little bit. See me a moment, huh? Mm. Just gonna work on. Okay, it's just gonna lean into me. Okay, I'm just yeah. gonna put the arm in an external rotation. It's gonna lean into me. I'm just trying to get the yeah the top part to just disengage from the AC joint. Hold there, hold there, hold there. Okay, back up. Okay, now raise up again. Try up. How's that? Done. Oh. Yeah. Oh. In fact, higher than the left. Is it? Yeah. yeah. It's very obvious. <laughs> it's very obvious. <laughs> yes. Done. Wow. Settled. Well, I can feel like like this. Wow. It. Oh, it's really gone. Yeah. That's what I say, record lah. <laughs> okay, okay, That's what I say, it's very fast. Okay, so now, because you've had this for about six to eight weeks, so after it was about two weeks, I'll use the warming uh, warming cream in order to uh, to 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 work on it lah. Okay? In this case, because, I mean, I can also try using the patches. So you put the patches there just to help to improve the, the, the circulation. So I'm going to use the warming one. So this is the warming one, mm -hmm. okay, and this comes in a quite a pretty big piece, okay, and then I'll usually cut it into small pieces, where I'll use my scissors to cut it, just, just. okay, I'll just cut it into, because this is where the ligament is, because the ligament is right next here, is this little small little ligament there, so I'm just going to cut a little small little piece. Is this, is this called like AC joint or something? Or? Uh, it's a ligament from your, your corococlavicular ligament. So it connects from the clavicle to the corocoid process. Okay. okay. I, I, words, I have. I <laughs> well, since you asked, <laughs> <laughs> there, are, there are three ligaments there. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. There's your cro there's a corococlavicular ligament, a corococlavicular ligament, and a corocohumeral ligament. That sounds like tongue twisters to me. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, yeah, so, I'm going to work on this. I'm going to just, this is the warming one, which okay. is a bit of, of, uh, of, uh, it's like some warming mixture, lah, okay? So, it's going there just to help to improve the circulation to speed up the healing. So, I'm gonna, just going to put it right there. And that's it. You're going to put it there for six to eight hours, okay? Mm. In fact, uh, when you shower, you can remove it. And then you can keep the rest. Oh, cut in small thank pieces. You. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. If you thank him, <laughs> huh? I can just give you more. I can give more. Huh? I can give more.